Okay, so this is yet another test of my setup. This time I'm trying to use my uh, cell phone and I want to, uh, in this test, maybe talk a, a little bit about Ramsey theory. So we're going to define the, um, the Ramsey number RNN to be the minimum M such that every graph on M vertices has either a complete graph on n vertices or an empty graph on n vertices as, uh, as a subgraph. Um, so the, the six people at a party puzzle is the statement that uh, R33 is equal to six. Uh, remember the proof of that. You take any graph whatsoever on um, six vertices and um, we want to argue that there's either a triangle or three mutually non-adjacent vertices. So just pick one of the vertices, and um, it's their five potential neighbors. So either this guy here is neighborly with at least three, or is not neighborly with at least three. Um, let's say that he's neighborly with at least three, then we have this kind of a structure. And now, if any two of these guys are neighborly, then we have three people who form a, a triangle. And if no two of these are neighborly, then we automatically have three people here who don't form a triangle, who form a, a, an independent set of size three. So, um, and of course, if, if this guy had, instead of being neighborly with three people, he was non-neighborly with three people, the same argument in, in just with neighborly and non-neighborly reversed would work. So that tells us that R3 is, is less than or equal to six. Six vertices is certainly enough. And to see that R33 is actually equal to six, we would take this graph here on five vertices. It clearly does not have a, um, a triangle and it also does not have an independent set of size three, because an independent set of size three would be a triangle in the complement, which is also C5, and so it clearly doesn't have a triangle. Okay, so, so that's uh, Ramsey theory 0000101.